good people welcome to my channel if you are new here karibu sana if you are my returning subscriber thanks for always coming back thanks for always sharing my video liking asanteni sana for always coming back for always putting that notification on so that any time i post a video you are always among my notification gang gang yay <laughs> thank you so so much and to my new subscribers Karibu ni sana. How far into your home? Please stay here. Don't leave because I have a lot, a lot to show you, okay? Without any further ado, let's get to the video. I got the courage of at least sharing whatever I wanted to share with you. Uh, at first, I was so, so hurt that I couldn't share this with any person, anyone around, only the people close to me, maybe in the house. <laughs> the only people who knew about this. So, let me tell you, and I want you to answer me. I don't know what happened. I don't know it was where I bought these things or about the, the guy who carried them for me. I don't know. Okay, just listen to this story then. You'll make your own judgment. Sawa sawa. <laughs> so this is what happened. <laughs> well, my cue, I'm cooking, but I just want to I just want to give you this story as I cook. <laughs> so this is what happened. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> You're not ready. You are not ready. So this is what happened. There was this day that hey, I got some kidogo money. And I thought that, eh, let me go and at least uh, do some kamukunji haul, eh? Nene ni katafted two plates, two nini, you know, the nine sufurias, it is see. Hmm? I had my 20,000, 20,000 Kenya shillings, can you imagine? Huh? So, I saved, after I saved, I said that, ha, huh, it's high time I go to kamukunji and buy some nice spoons, you know, uh, glasses, you know. Uh -huh. what we like you know ladies can understand ladies can relate so mimi uyo mimi uyo nikapandagari i went and took a public means to kamkunji you guy my guy are you ready <laughs> Do mimi nikashuka kamkunji with my money kwa simu yes because nowadays we don't we don't do cash i, I it's so rare to get me with cash for the people who know me Hiya. So I just went with my money, Kwasimu. I chose this, I chose this, I chose this. Nika penda hii, nika penda hii. Hey, they were packed, they were packed there. I even saw them. I even saw these things. Zikipakiwa. Everything was being packed. Everything. Was. And one thing I didn't do is to go with someone. I wish I went with someone. Who maybe has shopped there and an ajoizo ukora zote zile zinafanyika uko. It was so unfortunate that it took me so long to heal. So guys, this is a lesson before I even continue with my story. Next time you want to go somewhere maybe to shop or to do one to three things, at least be with someone else so that maybe they can be your third eye. Hey, 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 it was so bad. It was so bad. Now before we continue... Uh, there is an initiative that MC DRS has, and it's uh, in pro progress. Uh, we are feeding street kids. They call it Sahani Mtaani. Compassion in every bite. Eh? Please, come on this date. You'll see the poster there. Come on this date, and also support these people. This is MC DRS initiative. It's uh, your favorite MC in the 254, okay? I'll, I'll uh, interview him next week. 
so that you get to meet this guy, this superman, MC Dearest. He does a very good job for your events, for your weddings, uh, be it or a show, nyombo things. You can always count on MC Dearest. Sawa sawa. And he has, uh, he has organized something for us, for the, for the street kids or street urchins. Uh, so that we can go and feed with them. I'll put the dates on the screen there so that you can be among us when we gather together and eat with the street children. Sawa sawa. Make that a date. Usikose, content creators, come and meet with the street babies so that we can eat together. Higher. So, asa nindele na story yango sasa. Hey, do mimi. Do mimi sasa nafungiwa vitu zangu. And the mama is telling me, ah, unenda na hii. Ah, hii sufuria ni mzuri. Aha, aha. So, nanifungia, nanifungia. Sasa, I'm so excited. Sorry. I'm so excited. Mimi ndo uyo. <laughs> Nili rambwa. Nili, kilili rambwa. <laughs> kilili rambwa, my people. Hey, so box nikonayo. Box nikonayo ni mebeba vizuri sana. I'm carrying it, I'm walking. I'm so busy, ta 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 ta. So, the box was too heavy that I couldn't carry. I couldn't carry it on my own. It was so heavy. You can imagine the glasses na tunini. Easy cook and serve. And plus the, the, the glasses, then the glasses, you know, nini nini. Ah, things were so many that I couldn't carry alone. So I had to look for some guy out here. They have those two trolleys on a, on a, on a, on a songesha, songesha. Like they take you to the bus station or to where you have uh, ordered your Uber. Hmm? So mimi ndio uyo. Nikaenda kuinja. I told that mama that let me come back to take because I know the shop. Let me just go there, look for some guide. You see, beba. Mtu wakuja nisaidia kubeba so that we go and take it to Gary. Hmm. Little did I know. I went. Nika kuja na kijana. And he looked so, so decent. He was so nice. Nika sema, ah, twende, twende. Kuja nisaidia kubeba kitu pale. The girl was okay. I can be a sour. Let's go. So, I went with this guy. Where the shop was, I found that Mama is copying the gozangu. He was like, Ah, do we? Ah, chukua. Hmm. Ga chukua. No, sisi. The jama took it. Akabeba ju. You know it was too heavy that hang is aku hang. Akabeba ju. This girl was so kind enough. Kuniambia, Madam, tembe nyumayangu so that I don't get lost. Nika sema, Wow, this guy is so kind. So mi na tembe nyuma yake amebeba mzigo juu. Tukafika somewhere aka akaeka kwa trolley. So mimi sielewi by the way what happened. Did you really aka kwa trolley? Hata mimi I also saw that. Akaeka kwa trolley. So I was just walking nyuma yake nyuma yake. Tuna cross barabara. I'm just with him. We just walking, just going. Ai! Sisi hao. <laughs> Tunaenda. Kufika hapo mahali Gari kap, there was a car passing, matatu, so big that at a single one, it, see at it, it was a gari kadogo, it was so big, like a, a, a bus or, ma, or a matatu, kubwa, ikapita, sasa kupita, this guy still nika muwana, it's not like ali nipotelelea, nika muwana the other side of the road, but sasa I don't know what happened when the bus passed, I don't know what happened because ali kwa tuba do naturally, but ali kwa na mzigo yangu, yes, I was not so keen kwa ngale mzigo ni gani, but I just knew, ah, ndo ule. I was not so keen na kwa ngala mzigo. I just looked at him. Ah, ndo ule, ndo ule. So this guy was like, ah, madam, madam, niko hapa? Anaendesha, anaendesha. He, nikaenda kwa gari zetu. BS. We, we, we. Haya kufika pale. I don't know how I didn't even mark this box. Me, I don't know. So, akani pitishia, nika mwambia, nakapo kwa dere. And then, uh, box yangu kaiko hapo. Gari katoka tu, jamani kamilipa 100 yake, akaenda. <laughs> Machos, kilini ramba. So, mimi nikaenda, nikishuka kwa stage yetu. <laughs> ha! Nilishuka kwa stage yetu. Bas, mimi huyo, I look for someone, kijana, ni bebe hii. 
you know still like Johnny Click he boxy young box silly what about the brown the box I, I had a big brown box I don't know how things happened so to kena akani bebea vizuri to nikifika kwa nyumba so this guy me adin bebea nikam so to akaenda the sad thing is about to happen it's about to go down <laughs> fuke fuke <laughs> at least these days i laugh about it i used to cry when i think about my 20000s <laughs> so mimi huyo hehe kitchen eh na fungua vitu zangu now i want to panga them my things my things my things my things ah ah on opening the box oh my god these are just some some nini some cheap jugs jini nini ni to i don't know very very different things from what i bought like for real very very different from what i bought ana receipt yangu kuna vitu different na hizi do you know what nilipata nguvu ya kuenda town ya kurudi nini kamkunji immediately I didn't even carry these things. Ana zimbona niliwacha. I left them there. Nikachukua tena gari back to Kamkunji. I went to that shop. Aki uje nipatie vitu zangu, vitu zenye nilikuwa nazo, ni tofauti na ile city. The mama was like, "Ziko wapi? Iko wapi hizo vitu zako? Sima kufungia vizuri." Mhm. Unyumba nimefika na vitu tofauti. This mama was like, "Huyu kijana alikubebea mzigo. Ulikuwa kini?" Nikamwambia kini aje. Mimi mzigo tunaangalia kwa CCTV kitu ulitoka nayo hapa. He, let me tell you mine. This mama alichukua patik ya kuenda ku, ku, ku uh, check CCTV because nilimwambia sasa itakuwa police case. Hakuna haja mimi na na, na, na mlipa uh, full cash 21,000 alafu ananifungia vitu si zangu. Maybe nikamwambia okay, I was confused that maybe this mama exchanged these goods when I went to call that guy. Or that guy changed the box when the bus passed hey so i don't know that's a big question that i can't even answer i don't know mpaka leo mm -mm. but the, the the mama uh got me the cctv yo 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 ni footage i saw it and nikaona vinya linifungia vitu vizuri and when i went hakufungua halisongesha tu so you see yo cctv ndo i think maybe imenitolea doubt that i had with the mama Yeah. So I've been thinking that maybe it was the guy who exchanged my goods. I don't know. So this is a lesson a lesson you people. Next time you go to Kamukunji, <laughs> don't call anyone to carry for you any mzigo. Don't whatever I saw <laughs> Mimi don't ajua. Don't call anyone. Don't call anyone to help you carry the luggage. What you do? When you go there okay I've gone there again after the incident what you do this time what I did I went there I shopped nika eat a tuba I'm cooking as well don't mind even though vile nilirambwa and everything of mine ikaenda but it was so so sad that I couldn't report anywhere because The one I wanted to report was that mama. Unfortunately, she gave out her uh, her nini evidence akatoa CCTV. So yeah, yeah, I couldn't report her. I love you know, I can't even take that guy who helped me carry those luggages for Gary because I don't know him. I don't have his contacts. Actually, I, I even felt that if only he paid him via M-Pesa at least i could have tracked him you know but bila hiyo uh -uh. it was all lost hey, let me tell others can even potea waende na kila kitu yako you know so that's a wake up call i just wanted to let someone know that Nairobi ni shamba la mawe waliniramba waliniramba my guys so make sure you take note of that hmm? so that is it for today asante sana for sticking to the end I have been your girl Yvonne Shani. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share and also leave a comment down below. Tell me how you've been called in Nairobi or any other city. Okay. 
bye without any further ado i'll see you in the next video <laughs> bye